welcome to the project demonstration of iot battery management system with think speak voltage temperature soc and soh electric vehicles in this project we are using pic microcontroller wi-fi module buzzer and three relays and three voltage sensors we can see and also using three battery packs and also using a step down transformer rectifier and also another using another rectifier here at the same time we are using lcd display and temperature sensor so we are giving the power supply through this uh, to this system using this power cable tick to 30 volts of power supply that will be given to this step down transformer at the same time this uh, it, it will give to this rectifier so first of all it will see a step down transformer so step down transformer takes the 230 volts power supply the 230 volts power supply will be step down up to 12 volts 1 amp ac that 12 volts 1 amp ac will be connected to the uh, rectifier input the rectifier converts uh, ac to dc so it will convert up to 12 volts of dc that 12 volts of dc will be connected to the battery and these three relays will be connected between the rectifier and batteries so batteries will be charged using this rectifier whenever a relay gets switched on and also we can see this 230 volts power supply is parallelly connected with this uh, rectifier also so rectifier takes 230 volts of power supply and it will be stepped down uh, and it will convert up to 12 volts 5 volts of dc so it takes 230 volts ac and it will give 5 volts of dc that 5 volts of dc will be given to this pic microcontroller then pic microcontroller uh, equally divide the 5, 5 volts power supply to the LCD display, relays and Wi-Fi module buzzer. Now we will see how it will be works. So we are using our two different power supplies because if we, if we use this uh, 12 volts power supply to this PIC microcontroller, if, if the sometimes relay may get switched on then automatically uh, system will be restarted. That's why we are using two different power supplies for the charging purpose and also one power supply is for the charging purpose and another power supply is for the PIC microcontroller. So we need to give this uh, connection to the plug. So we need to set our hotspot settings. So here we can see we need to go for the hotspot settings. No. I have to change the point name. So here we can see pass, uh, output name should be Proyet 6675 and uh, password should be 129. Then save and also AP pin should be 2.4 GHz. Then only this Wi-Fi module will be connected to our phone. So here we can see one device is connected ESP729170 is the device name so after that we need to log into the ThinkSpeak app so here we can see after the logging of this uh, ThinkSpeak app uh, website we need to go for the IOT BMS so here we can see it is showing the battery, uh, battery 1 battery 2 and battery 3 and also showing the temperature values and also showing the SOC and SOH values also now we will see how it will be works so this three bat uh, each battery have a four uh, e here we are using four batteries so in the four uh, four uh, sorry three battery packs in three battery pack each battery pack have a each battery with a rating of 4 volts with the 1 amp so if the 4 volts is connected to series then it will become 444 is equal to 12 volts and a current will be same in a series voltage will be added current will be same so it will it is become 12 volt 1 amp battery and also this is also 12 volt 1 amp battery 12 volt 1 amp battery so these voltage sensors will be monitored the each uh, battery values so here we can see this battery connection is connected to the voltage sensor and this one also connected to the voltage sensor and this one also this uh, through the uh, voltage sensors so the voltage sensors output will be connected to the a0 a1 a1 pins so here we can see a0 a1 a1 pins from this voltage sensors output 
so this pic maker controller will uh, monitor the values through these voltage sensors now if any what uh, so now it is we can see the values over here temperature and p1 11 point and uh, p2 also 11 point 8 and p3 also 11 point 7 so if it is less than 10 volts then automatically this uh, relays will be get switched on at the same time now the batteries have 11, 11 volts now i am removing the uh, voltage, uh, voltage sensor input which is considered as a battery have a low voltage even that time relay will be get switched on automatically at the same time we can see p3 is zero in the same way so if i place this uh, battery it put to the voltage sensor then it will show us as a p3 value high and automatically this uh, relay will be get switched off at the same time p2 also so it will consider as a it battery have a low voltage then it will trigger on so if i place the battery value here then automatically relay get switched off at the same time this one also so these uh, batteries get charging through this rectifier and also if any temperature increases then automatically give a buzzer to our system now i am increasing the buzzer using this soldering machine so if it is more than 40 or 45 above then it will give a buzzer alert so it is uh, become 15 centigrade it will give a buzzer alert here so after it is become less than 15 then automatically buzzer will get switched off so here we can see values over here so battery voltage 1 so it will show them with the day time time so we can see so voltage is 11.1 with may 1st and 2024 now so here we can see at uh, 17 uh, uh, 7 so it is showing 19 so 7 uh, 18 we made a charge over here and battery 3 also and here we can see temperature value so we increase the temperature value that's why it is showing very high so we can see the time also 717 we did the same time we can see the SOC values over here and SOH SOH is nothing but a state of charge and SOH is nothing but a state of state of health so we can see the set of volt here also and if you want to download the data so go for the data import and export now here we can see there will be download option click on here and download it and it will be downloaded in a excel sheet so we can see the excel sheet format so in this way this part will be works thanks for the watching